is just something that I find fascinating. It really is a reflection of our landscape. It's, uh, we, we grow the, the malt, we grow the barley that makes the malt, the hops. So the quality of the beer really starts at the farm and it's, it's to do with the produce you get to start with. We are really uh, beholden to what nature gives us in the end. When most people think about climate change, they think about things like polar bears, and they might think about the risks to the Great Barrier Reef and places like that. What most people don't think about really is the risks to their food, the quality and how much and how much it costs, and they really don't think about their favourite drink, beer. Climate affects what we grow, where we grow it, and how much we grow of it. What we're really seeing now is the impacts of drought affecting our agricultural sector as never before. Obviously any, any climate change uh, will have an impact on the quality of the barley, which in turn will have an effect on the quality of the malt and then the beer. So when it came to drought draft, what we did was try and mimic some of the conditions in the event that water was less available, so too would be higher and perhaps some of the ingredients would be, would be more scarce. In terms of the, the malt, we kind of tried to mimic what would be a less modified uh, malt. The end result is the beer is probably more dry and a little less flavoursome and the malt's not really shining through. In terms of hops, we thought that they'd just be more scarce so there wouldn't be as many hops available, which means uh, less aroma and less of that sort of vibrant, citrus, punchy sort of flavour we get in some of our beers. Not really looking forward to doing this, but... Uh Yeah, look, it's, it's probably, it's not a great beer um, by any stretch of the imagination. Certainly that dryness and the almost metallic salinity sort of flavour is, is coming through and it's just lacking that character from the malt and the hops. As a craft brewer, it is a, it's a painful experience. We need a million different actions to solve the climate change problem. There's no one single answer and it's a fantastic initiative that Young Henry's is doing because if there's one thing that Australians really care about, it's their beer.